Alright, what's happening? Big Veil TV viewers, 12 volts base of more heads. I got um, a Magnavox 37 or 32 inch TV. Well, anyway, the daggone thing is cutting on and off, on and off. And a lot of people have also experienced the problem of the, the TV just not cutting on at all. It's just plugging in, no, no light, no nothing. Right here is a fuse. You can change that fuse out. Might have some luck. Uh, all you gotta do to take to, to access this is remove the screws around the outside of the panel. Basically, just you know, just pay attention. You know, just be observant and take all the screws off. Make sure you keep everything in order. I got the interior screws here. I got a couple of the screws that holds the AVs in right there. Here's the cover plate, but anyway, my problem was the TV was cutting on and off on its own. I went on and just checked all of the, you know, circuits in here, and I saw that on the power supply, we had a capacitor that was bulging. This one, two right here. Basically, I replaced those with some radio shacks. This one I actually had just laying around in the circuit board, you know, that was pretty good. And all I did was, you know, just kind of look through old circuit boards and stuff, took apart junk I didn't really want. And right here, let me zoom in, excuse my room. But right there is a, well, I think it's a 22,000 microfarad at 25 volts. That was the one I needed. There are also a bunch of them laying around in other circuits, you know, just have to fish through. But, you know. Saved myself a little money and time. Unfortunately, I had to buy the ones from Radio Shack. But I'm going to go on and get this thing together. And I'll let you know how it works. Oh, by the way, before you take this cover off, right here, there's a, a USB port. Make sure you don't snag that because, you know, that, that can cause some damage. Other than that, you know, you got the screws that holds the board down. Just regular Phillips head screws. Have at it, y'all. Don't be scared.